When looking to purchase a new car, you might consider trading in your current vehicle to fund part of your deposit. It's worth knowing what retailers are looking for and what is likely to increase or decrease their trade-in valuation. The following hints and tips could make a big difference. Cleaning your car thoroughly, inside and out, can do wonders for its value. You might even consider taking your car to be professionally valeted. Consider making any repairs your car may need before trading it in. However, be aware that this is a balancing act because you need to consider what the repairs will cost you compared to the potential value they'll add to your vehicle. You should do everything necessary to make sure your car is roadworthy. This means making sure the engine and electrics are in good working order. The tyres need to be above the legal limit and there shouldn't be any cracks or chips in the windscreen. Gather together all your car's paperwork, including the V5 registration certificate, often still called the logbook, and the most recent MOT test certificate. Hopefully you've kept a service record or receipts for work done on your car, or ideally both. A full service history can make a significant difference to your valuation. It proves your vehicle has been well maintained to the manufacturer's recommended standards. It may be worth doing some research on second-hand values to make sure you know what sort of valuation you can expect. But remember that the retailer is unlikely to offer you as much on a trade-in as you might receive selling privately. But a trade-in does save the hassle associated with advertising and selling your car yourself. Timing can also be important when selling a car. The younger your vehicle is, the more you're likely to sell it for. However, it's not just the age of your vehicle that can affect its value, but the time of year is also important. For example, a convertible is more desirable in the spring or summer, and a four-wheel drive may be easier for a retailer to resell quickly in the winter. So to sum up, make sure your vehicle is clean and roadworthy. Fix any minor damage and replace worn tires. Have all the paperwork ready, especially the service history and make sure you have a good idea of what you think the vehicle should be worth. It's that simple.